What's going on guys? Welcome back. Cam Collab. This is part two of Becky's editing tutorial. So I finished um her look, her outfit on this. Uh I just finished editing this look that she had with the dress and the flowery outfit. Now we're going to um I guess a top that it's that looks like a camisole I don't know not a girl but basically she's uh, wearing this top so we got a lot of greens lots of greens her top background and she's wearing jeans um, but we wanna we kind of lost a little bit of her skin color here so we're gonna try to bring that back but as far as this one because it's shaded this is really good so maybe we can go with this one it's pretty emo so what I would do is I kind of straighten it a bit it's, it's good and um, do the Instagram 4x5 yeah Alright, so what I would go for is my default setting of this. Let's see if it looks good. Looks good. It's very retro. Again, the greens are overpowering a, a little bit. So we're going to try to uh, manage that. So we're going back to this. And then what I like, what I don't like, is this blue here. Um, blue on the eyes, it tends to do that. So we're gonna click blueness. Now saturation, because it's still blue. I'm gonna let, just like deset that. But not too much, because we're gonna lose uh, details and information on the other blues so that's that uh, I kinda just wanna warm it up a bit and then Again, we were at a park, and it's this area is uh, more shaded than the others, the others like so. So I like her um, lips to be a little more red, and that's gonna bring out a little more of the skin vibrance. To adjust it a bit, and. Um, Let's see. Yeah, one more color. So let's sharpen, no masking, no no noise reduction. We want to make it vintage as as we can vertical make her face a little more elongated is it is it a bad thing to um adjust the face adjust anything eh, to a certain extent i mean the goal the goal is to make everything much more pleasing to the eyes on instagram um Fitness photos, yeah, you don't want to do anything too much on fitness photos. But with with fashion and uh, portraits, you, you want to make it as pleasing as possible. And staying true. That's just me. That's just my opinion. 
so a little more bright because it's we want to give light on the face it's already bad enough that her hair is covering half of her face but go back to 35 dehaze that's pretty pretty good really good all right Yeah, give some color. Um, a little too orange. Oops. something's missing here because there's kind of this patch here that's not lit well I'm gonna fix it with a little bit of graduated f filter see how that changes you see how that's a game changer right there boom with out with Boom. That's just a good lesson for everyone. How to use a graduated f filter. Too much. There you go. So we got color on this side. We got color on this side. It's very nice. Well balanced. Um, I would like to see a little more of shadow. Just, just a little more trace on this. So... We're gonna go back to our graduated filter, contrast it a bit. See, I want to see a little more of that detail. Highlights wise, should be fine. Shadows, boom, and whites, it's okay. I think uh, I'm pretty close to being done. Saturation boom it's very nice very nice all right guys um as our oh, just a little more just it's never enough all right that little touch that's the that little touch of color goes a long way boom not too much all right perfect so that's the before that's the after this is the before as you can tell we stylized the portrait looks much more pleasing much more mm, much more mm, i can't even say a damn word to describe it so hope you guys like this video Again, this is Jay from Cam Collabs, where I collab with other artists to make something happen. Hope to see you guys on the next one. Adios.